Do you wish you had more energy and a leaner body? The solution is quite a bit simpler once you understand how the body fuels itself. Lights run on electricity. Most of our cars run on gasoline. What do we run on? Food. When food is eaten and digested, it breaks down into smaller pieces. The protein is used mostly for our body composition. Carbohydrates and fats are mostly used for fuel. While this mix changes from moment to moment, on average, about half of our body's fuel comes from fat. The other half comes from carbohydrates, or more specifically, glucose. Some of our body is flexible about which fuel it wants to use for energy. But the hard and inactive muscles prefer fat. On the other hand, active muscles prefer glucose as a fuel. But not all parts of our body are flexible. For example, the brain and the red blood cells that transport oxygen throughout our body, they require glucose as a fuel, and a lot of it, about 800 calories a day. That's just one of the reasons why we should be eating a moderate amount of carbohydrate at every meal to fuel our brain and red blood cells. If we skip or skimp on a meal, the body can't turn fat into glucose. In fact, to fuel the brain, the body's going to have to burn down lean muscle mass to convert it into glucose. In other words, even if you worked out last night and built up lean muscles, the body's going to chisel away if you skip breakfast. So if you want to keep your energy up and your body lean, it's important to eat on a regular basis throughout the day. This is Dr. Joe, professional speaker and author of Reboot, How to Power Up Your Energy, Focus, and Productivity.